and then roll onto your back, bring both legs up on the wall. So now if you find you can't straighten your legs on the wall without your butt lifting up like this. Okay. What you want to do is you want to scoot away from the wall until your tail, your tailbone right here, until it drops to the ground. So you should feel a slight arch in the low back, just a little bit. And then what you're going to do is you're going to bend one leg. And so I'm bending my right knee. You want the ankle right about at the knee. It doesn't have to be down here. It doesn't have to be up here. If you can only go to there, that's fine. But right about ankle should be at the same height as the knee that's straight. So now I'm going to take my right hip and I'm going to take my right hip up and I'm going to horizontally take it towards my right ear. And as I take it to my right ear, I hold it in that position. I tighten up my left thigh and then I pull back my foot like this. Now, if your foot is rotated this way, the knee is going to point out to the side. So you want to take the outer edge, I'll demonstrate with my right knee. If I'm going to take the outer edge of my, of my foot, I'm going to turn it this way, and you can see how my knee turns in. So ideally, the knee should be pointing straight back behind me. If it's like a headlight, it's being straight back behind me here. So on this side, I'll be, I would be taking up my left hip and rotating this in, tightening my quad, letting my tailbone drop down. Don't tuck the tail so that lifts up. Let it drop down and then relax the upper body as much as you can by bringing your hands out here and then just relaxing and breathing. Hold for one minute. Then you do the other side for one minute. Pull the hip up, coming back and then repeat that for one to three to five sets.